hey what is happening what is going on welcome back to the channel if you're new here make sure you subscribe hopefully you enjoy this video quick one i'm going to show you how to create a curtain animation and it's actually really easy hopefully you learn something hopefully it helps you let's get into it so let's delete this go to shift a mesh add a plane then what you want to do is go r x 90 and then just go s scale it up something like that okay then what you want to do is go here and just scale it to something like that click tab right click subdivide and give it about 40 subdivisions and now what you want to do is select all these top things so just go over it like this it's perfect and then what you want to do is click here and hit plus and hit assign okay and then go to the tab and then go here so click plus twice and then go back to tab and go s scale these in something like that and then what you want to do is you can go to tab go here and go to timeline boom bring this up Make sure your plane is selected. Now what you can do is just change this end to like 100. So it's not as long. And obviously if it's 250, it's gonna be a lot longer. You don't want it to be so long. And then click here to add a keyframe. Now what you wanna do is drag your timeline all the way to 100. And then drag this value all the way to one. And click here. Perfect. Now let's drag this back here. Let's go here to physics. So boom, add a class modifier. Then you want to go down to shape. So go here, boom. Add this group, click on it. And then let's go here to modifiers, boom. Add, look for subdivision. Add a subdivision surface modifier, bring this up to three. And then what you want to do is right click, shade smooth on the plane. Then add another modifier, look for solidify. And then just change this to about 0 0.001. Hit plus or hit enter. Now what you want to do is go back to physics. Go to cache. Change this to 100. And then hit bake. Give it a few seconds. And now check the magic happen. Look how cool that is. So if I hit spacebar boom brings it in and there we go now we can leave it there it looks pretty cool and then you can add like a material so let me just go to the cycles boom 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 and i've got real-time materials so just going to quickly throw in a quick material go to class boom Hit that. Boom. Look how cool that looks. And there we go. That easy. So I'll upload this to the Patreon. You can download it for free. And yeah, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Make sure you subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.